Hi friends, welcome back to our channel. Today we are going to unbox and check out our new chemistry set from Ooze Labs that we got for Christmas. We absolutely love doing science experiments and we hope you guys enjoyed this one. Um, it's an oil and water experiment and we can't wait to check out this new set. And we'll be doing a lot more cool experiments from this set in our next uh, several episodes. So stay tuned and let's check this out together. We do the oil and water. We need, we need nose it and then shake it, right? Yes, okay. So first, we have 30 milliliters of water and 30 milliliters of vegetable oil. Okay, so we also have a large cup. So how about you pour into the large measuring cup to the 30 milliliters of water. Pour it in. Okay. Now pour the oil. What do you see? What does it look like? It looks like slime. <laughs> it looks like slime? Mm-hmm. Okay, so now use the spatula to mix it. This one? And then when you close it? No, first mix it. Let's see what happens. What's happening? Is the water and oil mixing? Uh-huh. You sure? No. It's not mixing. That's crazy. What if you mix faster? Is it mixing? No? No. No. Hmm. Okay, so now let's take this and pour it into a test tube. Okay, and then we need to mix it again. Now take it. Is it fully closed? Yes. Now shake it really hard. Shake, 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 All right, so now we're gonna let it sit for 30 minutes and then we'll come back to it and see what happens, okay? Okay, is it color yellow? Yes, I see the color yellow. That means that it's white and it sits for 30 minutes so it turns yellow. That's a part of the You think so? Yeah. Well, we're gonna find out. That's why we're doing this experiment. Right? Mm -hmm. okay. 30 minutes passed. Let's open our test tube. <clears throat> okay, open it. And then put a few drops of dish soap. <clears throat> yep. Not a lot, just a little. Done. Maybe. Let's see. Okay, now close it up again. Nice and tight. And then shake, shake, shake. Shake, shake, shake. And shake some more. And a, re a reaction? Maybe. Let's see. What do you think is happening? Other than there's a ton of bubbles. Does it look like oil and water finally mixed? Yeah. Hmm. So do you know what happened? 
you know? So oil and water actually don't mix together because water molecules, these little tiny things that water is made of, are polar. Oil and water do not mix because water molecules are polar while oil molecules are non-polar. Do you know what that means? <clears throat> they don't actually stick to each other. So polar means that one side of the molecule has a slight positive charge while the other has a slight negative charge. Water is polar because the oxygen atom is much larger than the hydrogen atom and pulls the negative electrons towards itself. This influences the way that water interacts with other molecules. But like, unlike water, oil is not polar. So they don't actually, <clears throat> they don't have the different positively and negatively charged ends like water. So they're able to stay mixed when you add the dish detergent because the detergent acts as an emulsifier. So it actually bonds them together. Otherwise, they won't stay together. and ever and ever. What did you think about that experiment? Was it cool? Very interesting. Thanks for joining us today, guys. We'll see you as we check out this next experiment in our next video. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. And give us a comment about what you'd like to see us do in the future. Thanks again for joining us. We'll see you next time. Bye. You!